Vaults, and today we are starting a new series called Silence of the Hams. Because we are going to put together cooking and shooting by using the heat of our suppressors. And today we are going to be making suppressor brunch rolls. So what we have here is we have our rugged obsidian 45 and I have my Taurus 1911 45 safety check. We're clear. No magazine. And we're going to twist the suppressor on and we are going to cook with it. We are also going to utilize our rifle suppressor for cooking. There are people out there who just wrap bacon around a barrel of a rifle and something and it slides off. We are going to try something different. So what we have here is I've wrapped some parchment paper around the suppressor. I got some tin foil here ready. And we have a couple strips of bacon here. We're going to take one. I'm just going to rip it in half. And we're going to go long ways. Lay that one. That kind of makes it stick. Here's another way. Oh. We need to lay this on the suppressor because we're going to roll it up. Looks like we got room for a whole other slice yet. Yep. All right then. We're gonna try this, and then now I'm gonna just wrap it with the tin foil so it doesn't fall off. This might work. This might not. The tin foil is just to hold it down. Look at that. Easy peasy. There we go. Open that up. Ha <laughs> ha. This might actually work. Sure hope you can see that okay. We got some bacon sticking out here. We gotta shove that in. Yeah, we don't we don't want that projectile fling and then it's the bacon out. Well it's not the projectile, it's the uh, we don't want any extra excess powder coming out getting all over the bacon. Ew. There we go, wrapped up. That would be a piece I want. Alright. All right, I got some 10 round magazines loaded up. Just your standard 230 grain ball ammo. Here we go. Now it's a suppressor, not using any ears. And I got my steel target here, about 11 yards away. We need to. I don't like that. We need that further, further away. Oh my God! Did you hear that? <laughs> you know what that was, Gary? It was like. <laughs> no, that means that that's ammo that could have come back and hit us. Oh. That's bad. Yeah. Because I heard it thump over there. Uh, that could be dangerous. All right. After the first couple of shots, we had to move the target down a few more yards, and it's come a little loose. So we're going to try a quick rapid fire here to see if we can get it warmed up. Woo! That's coming all the way off. <laughs> I don't know if it's getting hot at all. It's getting warm, but it's sliding off. We might have to reset this thing. Uh oh. We have a failure. Yeah, we do. I think those bacon's, I think the bacon's rolling up in there. All right, so what happened is, is that the parchment paper slipped out and it got all nice and black. I don't know well you can see that. So, Let's try it without. How hard, how hard is bacon grease going to be on a suppressor? Uh, 
that. But I can feel it. It's it's getting warm. Here we go. Next ten rounds. Ooh, we're kind of falling apart here. <laughs> the bank is kind of slipping out. Because <laughs> the tin foil's coming apart. Do we need tape or something? I don't have any tape. Ah, oh, shoot. It could have really worked. The suppressor's getting really hot. So let's try to get this bacon shoved back in there. Bacon. I think we need another layer of tin foil. That should hold. One thing I didn't anticipate was the bacon grease getting everywhere. <laughs> Flashing her face, that would be hilarious. Here we go. Plus, we're using really, really thin, crappy tin foil here. Well, there we go. I can feel the heat. I can feel the the suppressor got hot. Good, we're cooking some good old bacon. Yes, we are. All right, so there was 20 rounds. Here's another 10. Thing barely even moved. Wow! It well, holds. I'm not hearing. I'm not hearing sizzling, but I'm feeling heat. Because maybe it's sizzling inside, and you just can't hear it. Ooh, there's one spot where it's really nice and hot. Boy, I'm getting bacon grease all over my brand new suppressor. All right, here we go again. Another ten rounds. I got one more seven round mag. We're gonna empty that and then we'll see how it went. How come we know here no sizzle? Like you said, it's underneath the tin foil. Here we go. Woo, dang. All right, so. 47 rounds we just went through. Wow. Yeah, this is really hot, I think. We'll let that sizzle for a minute. Shoot, see how it, we'll see how well it retains its heat. Okay, while we waited for this to, you know, it's still warm. That's been sitting here about a good five minutes because we picked up some of our brass. So let's give this a check, shall we? Now, I'm not expecting sizzling crispy bacon. But it was pretty darn warm. We're warming up real nice. I didn't really want to put the bacon directly on the suppressor with the tin foil, but aluminum foil, just foil, whatever. There's a slice that hung out. So we're un undoing this here. Oh, that's a lot of grease. Yeah, but we're cooking. Look at that. It's even sticking to it a little bit. Look at that. We're cooking. Oh, we forgot to put oil spray on it. Yeah, we. well, you don't need oil spray with bacon. Does its own non-stick grease. Yeah, we're sticking. We're cooking. We're cooking. 47 rounds and we're about <laughs> halfway just down. a little under halfway there. So we're gonna shove that one piece back in here. And Let's roll this back up. Two layers of foil. Wow, look at how messy this got. Now, this is our first time ever doing this, so bear with us here. Plus the suppressor's still warm. Here we go, we got a double wrap here. Yeah, this is a mess, I know. On a new table. All right, so we are wrapped up tight. So we saw what putting parchment paper on it would do. Then we saw what 47 rounds would give us. And it was about halfway done. So hopefully another 40 firing quickly ought to do it. <laughs> All 
All right. So there was 10 rounds. Let's see what we got. Enemy, enemy fell. All right, another 10 rounds. Enemy has fell again. Ooh, that's hot. Oh, we are at 67 rounds so far. It'll be this will be 77. This right here is going to be 87 rounds total. After this, we'll check it out. Suppressor hasn't even come loose. Hot, 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 hot. Holy moly, bacon grease just splattered at me. That's hot. Dang. The alien is spewing acid. Yo, ow, dang. We're going to let that sit and let the residual heat finish the job. Okay, so this has been sitting for a little while. Again, we were picking up brass and cleaning up around here a little bit. And this is actually still warm. Now, I'm not exactly expecting super crispy bacon, but... We're expecting regular bacon. Cooked, we're expecting bacon. cooked bacon. So let's unroll, un unroll it here. Well, that's kind of done. Kind of. Okay. It smells good. It does smell good. Safety check. All right, the bacon's sticking to it pretty good. Uh, yeah, there we go. So it's not crispy. But it's for the most part kind of done. I'm gonna try. We could try one, a few more. What do you say? A few. Or is that? Do you think that's good for you? Here. No, no, no. Oh, uh, let's try it. Probably not gonna be the best. There you go. Here we go. One let's roll best, that up. One of the best parts of the video. Taste testing. You can never get enough of it. All right, so there is our greasy suppressor now. <laughs> Let's wrap this up and save this for the rest of the video, the next part of the video. So this time we have Garrett who's going to shoot the rifle. Then I have parchment paper and tin foil set up here. The rifle is empty. And we have some eggs we're going to scramble and put on there when it's really hot. Let's see how this turns out. Let's start by scrambling a couple of eggs. I'm only going to do one egg right now just to see if it works. Oh, I forgot the salt and pepper. We're out in the field. Eggshells are biodegradable. Okay, we got scrambled egg mixed up. Garrett, go ahead and load up. Let's see how hot this thing gets first. Go ahead and rack the slide. All right. I like how I did that. Okay. Give me five rapid shots. This... Wait. All right, we had to stop a second to make sure you got a safety glasses put on. Go ahead and give me five good shots. Safety on. Hand away, there we go. How hot are we? Not hot enough. That's not go ahead. Give me another five. Okay. Not 
Nice shooting hitting the steel, by the way. Thank you. Okay, you're walking back here. Keep the suppressor forward. Ooh, we're getting warm now. Ooh, yeah. Give me another five. Now, make sure the rifle stays forward. You're walking the rifle back. There you go, right there. Okay, hold up, safety on. How are we doing? Woo, okay. All right, let's try this. Little bit of egg, little bit of egg. Oh, it's just running everywhere. Ah! Oh no. Hot, 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 hot. How is it not cooking? It is so hot. Let's try the other side here. It's just running out. This might be coming <laughs> I should have saw this coming. There, a little bit. Oh. Hurry up, give me another five. <laughs> it's splatter everywhere. Oh. Hurry up, it's cool enough. <laughs> That's enough. Okay, how are we doing? Ooh, yeah, we're cooking eggs now. Thin layer, but it's sizzling. Sizzling? Oh, yeah. A oh. little bit. A little bit. It might just run off into the side and cook underneath. It Ooh, hot, do. hot, hot. Yeah, it's running a little, but it's not running out. Oh. Sorry, folks. I'm sorry you can't see this. There, a little bit more. All right. Oh, Give me some more. Folks. Five more shots. Awesome. Come on, come on, come on. That's enough. Five shots. Ooh, I can hear it sizzling. Let me close this up a little more. And do kind of like, maybe it'll wrap around. Kind of like an omelet, maybe. Ooh, I like omelets. We are actually cooking egg here, folks. As it runs out the front. <laughs> and now it's running off the back. Yeah, running out the back. This must not be the greatest omelet, but at least we made history with it. Can you cook with eggs? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, this is a, probably not the best camera angle. Let me try this here. Pouring a little bit at a time. Quick, five more shots. Will do. Hurry up, it's oozing. It's oozing out. Are you? I'm out. All right, all right, hold on, hold on. He's out. Let's check this here. Ooh, we're actually cooking some egg. Nice. A little bit, very little. Ooh, you can smell it. Come here, come here, take a whiff. Oh, that's <laughs> Yeah, that smells good, yeah. Here's gonna be another wild, crazy idea. I'm gonna pour some more in there and then close this up. Yup, yup. Crazy. This is crazy. I think it's the parchment paper that's killing us. Not so bad. Yeah, ow, hot. Dang, this is hot. How is that drooling so fast with that being so hot? It's just what this table is. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, that's why that tore right there. Woo, this is hot. Oh, man. Okay, so <laughs> let's get a closer look here, shall we? Okay, as you can see, we are empty. It's oh, all locked oh. to the rear. Are we using some more? Yeah, we're oozing out here a little bit, but we're cooking on the sides. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yeah, okay. We have some fresh omelets. So, well, yeah, this might be more of an omelet than scrambled eggs. That's fine. I like omelets. All right. So we are going to reset here. See if we can make this go without oozing out. Okay. So what I tried to do here. 
Because I tried to wrap some around the front and the back and do like this little opening here. But I tell you what, this is so hot, I burnt my fingers doing that. So what we're going to do is we're going to try one more mag and finish that one egg. All right, go ahead. Give me five rounds. That's hot. That is really hot. We still got the one egg, just the one. The we'll see how this one goes. If we have to, we'll put another one. All right. Five. Okay, safety on, hands off. Yeah, that blew that top piece off there. So here we go. Let's see how that turns out. How bad is that gonna ooze out of there? Not bad at all. All right, so yeah, I know I'm covering up what I'm doing here. There we go. <laughs> this kind of holding. Hurry up, give me five more shots. Keep that hot, let's keep that hot. Okay, stop. Safety on, hands off. Now, that suppressor is smoking. Let's see how this is looking here. Oh, my egg is oozing out in the front. No. You see that? Oh. I'm gonna come around the back of the rifle so I'm not going in the front. Oh, man. Oh, no. Yeah, it blew so much of the tin foil off, it's oozing out the front there. <laughs> How's this looking up here, though? It looks yummy. It's cooking. It's a cooking. Yeah, see, it's even cooking right there on the side. You can see the white and all. Dang, it's almost like we should have taped this on somehow. Again, this is only our first effort at this, folks. So we didn't come out here to actually just give up. We're gonna try again. Again, we're out in the field, so. Again, it kills my biodegradable. Okay, this thing is still really hot. Now, what I'm gonna try to do is I was adding a little too much at a time, honestly. So, we are going to try this again. That actually is still hot. We picked up brass again. It's been about at least five minutes and that suppressor is still hot. So, a little bit at a time here. Okay, give me five rounds, let's go. How did that turn out? It's holding. Let's try a little bit more on the other side. Okay, hurry up, five rounds. Quickly, quickly, quickly. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, safety on. We are not, oh, we're still losing out the front here. Ouch, hot. Oh, dang. Ha. Whew. How is that just oozing out and not cooking right away? I don't know but I am getting egg all over my suppressor. <laughs> but we are cooking in there. We really are. It's worth it. Ooh. Come here. Very carefully, there's a run in the chamber, the safety on, get your ear up there. We're sizzling. We're sizzling. Yeah, let's see if we can get this on the camera here. I don't know if you can hear that, we're sizzling. <laughs> That's kind of what the whole uh, premise of this is. It does get that hot. That hot. That hot. So, while that is sizzling there, we got some more here. You have excess egg. A little bit. I want to open this up, but all that sizzling is cooking the egg right here, making it ooze out less. So, that's perfect. A little bit. Oh, you know what else we forgot? What? I brought a little thing of cooking oil too. Stop forgetting that. You stop forgetting that. How did I? Mm. Okay, so we're gonna put a little bit more. All right, you ready? Ready. Get up there. Again. Okay, here we go again. Get up there. Okay, go go. Five rounds. Hurry up. Right. Yeah, we're sizzling. 
I could hear it from over here. Oop. Am I drizzling? Where? You're drizzling in the back. All right. Ow, ow, dang, hot. <laughs> All right. We're going to wrap that up. And whatever egg is in there, I'm going to let that cook here. I still got a little bit left here. There we go. Again, yeah. Maybe if I hold it. Hot, 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 hot. Whew. Dang. Owie. Yep, this That's is hot. Weird. I'd have you come and touch it, but no. that'd be a little unsafe. Don't you dare. You can burn your fingers. I don't want to burn my fingers. All right, so I have a wooden skewer here for shish kebabs. I brought to push it around a little bit, get it to cook even. All right. That's helping. Look at that. I don't, I don't know how well you can see that from up there. There we go. We're scrambling it up a little bit. Ooh, yep. That looks good. It does actually. <laughs> Let's get some. Uh, this roll is gonna be delicious. This this uh this suppressor is so hot. It's still sizzling. Still. Still. But just like you know what, still. just like on a frying pan, you actually have to still. really be touching it. I think the parchment paper is kind of hindering it too. Weird. All right. Some of that's cooking is turning brown. Yeah, it is actually. Good, that's how scrambled eggs are. That's how every scrambled egg is. We got this, uh, there's half of this egg left. Yeah, so, and we're here. about out of ammo. Yeah, we are about. So, what are we gonna do with all this? Hold on. Ouch, hot. Ouch, dang, that is freaking hot! Woo! Alright, give me another, give me another five rounds. All right, you're out. All right, whatever heat's left is all we got. All right, safety on. Okay, safety on, the bolt's locked to the rear. Let's take the mag out and leave the bolt open. Here we go. Might not be the best egg. Oh, no, it won't be, but. Right. Here, I know, again, I am really sorry. I'm covering it up with the bowl. Don't you roll out of there. Stay right where you're at. There, I can finally get a little spot where it can cook. Hot. Hot suppressor. Woo! Woo, that's a lot. Yeah, I know. Finally, it's pooling up the way we want. Here we go. Oh, don't ooze out. Don't ooze out. It's going to ooze. There we go. All right. Now, I'm stirring it up here a little bit to get it to cook here. We'll just let that sit and let the residual heat on that suppressor. Damn! That is hot. Again, the suppressor is completely empty. We're oozing out over here. Okay, that stopped it. Close that up and let the residual heat cook that. Okay, that's what our suppressor looks like now after it's been cooking some eggs. But we're not done yet, are we? Nope. What are we gonna do next? We are going to cook bread. That's right. This is gonna look crazy, I know. This is gonna be. <laughs> Something we're gonna different. roll that and then we're gonna roll that blood up, cover the bottom and put. So what I have now is you'll see. You'll see. So we got eggs and we got bacon. Now it's time for some bread and butter. It's kinda room temp, kinda not. Oh. I put it in the cooler with some ice blocks and it had a chance to <laughs> get a little solid on us. Yes. So we're going to spread this a little heavily then. All right, so let's just put the butter right in the middle, and then as this we put this on the suppressor hot, we'll let the suppressor melt it. What do you say? Yeah. All right, so we got the butter in the middle of the bread here. All right, dude, load up. The last piece of the roll, folks. All right, let's see how this works now. All right then. That's perfect. Now give me five rounds. Okay, five rounds. Let's see how hot this gets. It's our 
fire. Off the edge. Woo, hot. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. We're going to try to toast bread on the suppressor. <laughs> oh, look at it melt that butter. Oh yeah. That looks good. Oh it the butter's sizzling. The butter sizzling? Yeah, the butter's sizzling. <laughs> I didn't know butter could sizzle. Look at that, the butter spread itself on the bread. Sort of. Sort of. Okay, give me five more rounds. Now, don't worry about hitting the steel, just give me five. Pop, 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 pop. Uh, here we go, out. here we go. There we go. Kind of toasted the bread here. Feel the heat of the suppressor through the bread. We have, we have toasted bread. Well, what if we just set it on there and just let it sit? Let's try that. <laughs> yeah, we got some toasted bread here. That's right. I'm smearing butter and bread on my suppressor. Okay. We got one. It's not quite toasted, but it's good and warm. It has enough butter on it, too. All right, so we got another slice of bread here. I'm gonna set that on there so it doesn't fly away. Yeah, the outside, actually the outsides have kind of crisped up a little bit. Might have been a little too much butter, but it was cooked. That's now, good. we got the heel. Last two slices of bread on the bag. So we're going to do the same thing. Uh, I'm going to put a little less butter this time. Hey. Too, mu too much butter made it a little soggy. Yeah. Almost so I think that ought to do it. It almost made it look like the color of a sponge. There we go. So I'm going to seal this butter up. Instead of, but instead of sponge, All right. Bob. Give me five rounds. Heat that suppressor back up. Let's go. Nice shooting. We got the steel at about a good 55 yards away here. Here we go. Suppressor's hot. Instead of SpongeBob, we have Sponge Bread. Whew. Spreading that. Oh man, that's sizzling. But dang, that suppressor's hot. <laughs> Again, the heel. The heel of the piece of bread. I'm feeling it. All right, so we have our bread. We have our bread. Again, the outsides it got a little toasted, but the inside got mushy because of the butter. So, let's uh, empty this out now. Okay, rifle safety check. Now, let's get to eating. Okay, folks, we got everything cooked up here. The reason why I call these suppressor brunch rolls is because we usually have bacon, eggs, and toast for brunch on the weekends, and that's about it. So here we got our bread, our eggs, and our bacon. There we go. Here's some eggs for this half. A little bit. Didn't get a whole lot because you saw how much drizzled out. But what stayed behind got cooked. go <laughs> not much there but there's some then we got our bacon it's turned out actually perfect not too bad not too bad slice for you a little slice for me we brought cheese the wind's gonna blow everything away would you like cheese i would like cheese there you go some cheese cheese. There we go. Even them out. These look good. Now we have 
We like tapatio with our breakfast. Breakfast foods. Would you like some? Yes, please. Say when. That should be enough. That should be enough. There we go. Now, <laughs> let's roll them up and dig in. That's right, we cooked this with suppressors and it was only our first try. I'm not expecting a champion meal here, but to suppressors. To suppressors. Not bad. <laughs> mm. I can't believe it, folks. We actually made this work. Mm. It's good. It's good. Mm. <laughs> we definitely need to make this again. Oh, yeah. Mm. So, we made a mess. We had a bit of a fuss. Some things didn't work out, some things did. Our experiment, for the more part, most part, worked. <laughs> Not gonna get it best on the first try. Mm -mm. If you would like to support us and see more videos like this, cooking more food items, we uh, started a Patreon account. So, if you'd like to become a Patreon and see more activities like this with more experiments with food and maybe some more tactical shooting or Garrett shooting more competitions, log on to our Patreon page and uh, give us some support. Subscribe! <laughs> do you have any extra bacon in there? As a matter of fact, I do. Open that up. There you go. Thank you. More sauce? More sauce, please. More sauce. There you go. Thank you for watching our very first episode of Silence of the Hams. If you want to see more videos like this, please donate to our Patreon page and make sure to like our videos and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Alright. Are we done? Mm-hmm.